Welcome to Second Life Upcycling. In my Fashion Designer Dupe series, I'll show you how I source inspiration from some of the world's best designers to refashion and upcycle clothes that I buy thrifting. In this video, I sourced inspiration from Victoria Beckham's collection to upcycle a men's jacket into a tuxedo dress or a jacket dress. I picked up this impeccably made men's jacket from my local thrift store for $5. From the tags inside, it appears it had been commissioned by London tailors John Morgan & Co. I did some research and they were founded in 1825 and tailored clothing for British Prime Ministers, aristocracy, even John F. Kennedy. It's heartbreaking to find magnificent pieces like this in thrift stores, often destined for landfill or to be cut into rags. I hope I have done its heritage justice and it will now enjoy a second life in my wardrobe. The first step was to remove the lining. I kept the labels for posterity and will use them on another upcycling project as a homage to the original tailors. Jackets of this calibre are heavily padded to give them structure. For the purpose of this project, I removed all the padding, including the large shoulder pads. On my small frame, the padding would give the impression that the jacket was wearing me instead of the other way around. Next, I removed the sleeves. To finish the new seams, I hemmed these with bias binding. I chose a burgundy colour for this, so if the seams peek through, it will add a pop of colour. I thought bias binding would be perfect for this heavy fabric, giving structure and stability to the new sleeve hem. I then had to reduce the size of the sleeve hole. It was a man size and gaped way too much. And finally, I removed the buttons and moved them vertically across so the dress was more fitting on me. I was able to use the existing buttonholes, which saved me a ton of time. To mark where the new buttons needed to be sewn, I marked through the buttonhole with chalk. And here it is finished. This really is an easy upcycling project and would be suitable for sewers without much experience, and it could even be hand sewn. Thanks for watching. If you would like to see more upcycling tutorials like this, please give me a thumbs up. I upload upcycling, sewing and thrifting videos weekly, so subscribe so you don't miss an update. See you next time.